Hey, what's going on, my pigeon flying friends? Today, I have an exciting announcement to make, which is a new feature, and it's going to be inside the incubator. The incubator is your video library, and what's really cool about it is you can upload, uh, let's say, a week's worth of content inside of here, and then you can schedule out your videos from there. And we just tried to make a very easy place that you can drag and drop your video files into. And another cool feature that you can actually do, uh, which I'm going to share with you today, is inside the three dot menu here. If I click on it, you'll now see an option that says save video. And just like that, I have saved my very first video. And so based off of the plan that you're on, you're going to be able to save a certain amount of videos. And so uh, for this, for example, I've got three videos here that I can save. So I can go through here and I can just click save. And what's nice about this is let's say you are a church, okay? And let's say uh, you had a very important sermon or that you gave like a really good message that you want to save. The nice thing is you can save that video file and then you'll have the ability if let's say you didn't have a good internet connection and you couldn't get your video file uploaded, well, it'd be good to, to at least send something out to your audience or to your congregation in this example so that they have something to view. That's one example is a church, right? Let's say you're doing a five-day challenge. Well, you could potentially, depending on what plan you're on, save up to five video files inside your saved videos where you can continue to keep repeating and uploading your video files as you go. After seven days, these videos will delete out of your videos, but the saved videos will stay and they will remain. And then you'll be able to then take and go live with them. And the reason that we actually have your videos delete is so that we can keep our server costs low because once your videos go live to the social media platforms that they're going to, they're the ones doing the hosting. So if you're going to Facebook, Facebook hosts your video. If you're going live to YouTube, YouTube then hosts your video. So we would then delete your video files to save on costs, right? And if we can keep our server costs low, then that we can keep our price of our software low. So we're pretty excited about this feature. Again, we put our contact information at the bottom of every screen because we want to hear from you. And if there is a feature that you're like, oh, if it only did this, let us know. We're listening. And uh, again, we just want to come up with what is a really good solution to helping support you to get your message out to the world. So that's all I got for you for this video. I hope you're super excited about this new announcement. Um, and uh, I guess get in there, save some videos, and have fun with it. Thank you so much, and until next time.